Plantar fasciitis, the most common cause of heel pain. Plantar fasciitis is classically known for causing pain in the heel at the first step in the morning. The pain can feel like a stone bruise, a sharp dagger, deep throbbing, or a dull ache. Plantar fasciitis is the tearing, inflammation, and degeneration of the plantar fascia, a long ligament in the bottom of the foot. The inflammation is the result of small micro tears within the plantar fascia. The inflammation causes pain at the inside of the heel where the plantar fascia inserts on the heel bone. The traction on the heel bone from stress of the plantar fascia may cause a heel spur to form. Although heel spurs are commonly seen on x-ray, they are rarely the cause of pain. The cause of plantar fasciitis is multifactorial. The combination of abnormal motion in the feet, usually over pronation, in combination with an unsupportive pair of shoes and overuse can cause microscopic tears in the plantar fascia and start the process. Some common conservative therapies for plantar fasciitis include icing, stretching, heel lifts, supportive shoes, weight loss, taping, orthotics, and night splints. An ice massage with a frozen water bottle for 15 minutes two to three times a day will both stretch the plantar fascia and decrease inflammation. Stretching is one of the more important treatments and should be done multiple times a day, including before stepping out of bed. A plantar fascia specific stretch has been shown to be the most beneficial. A heel lift can decrease the stress on the plantar fascia. Tight calf muscles lead to the heel coming off the floor early and this places excess stress through the plantar fascia, which results in tearing, inflammation, and pain. Supportive shoes are one of the most important steps. A shoe which is too soft and flexible will strain the plantar fascia with each step. Think about a shoe as a brace to the ligament protecting it while it heals. Taping is a method designed to take stress off of the plantar fascia to allow it to heal. The method shown here is a low die strapping and can be an effective short-term treatment. Orthotics are rigid devices placed in the shoe and designed to control abnormal motion and prevent arch collapse. By placing the foot in the correct position, it will take stress off the plantar fascia and allow it to heal. Night splints can be very beneficial as they help keep the plantar fascia stretched out while you sleep. When sleeping, the foot is in a relaxed position. During the night, the calf and the plantar fascia contract and tighten. In the morning, the plantar fascia is in a tightened, shortened position. When full body weight is placed on the foot, the fascia becomes overstressed and tears. Night splints hold the ankle up and pull the toes back, stretching both the calf and the plantar fascia during the night, allowing the fascia to heal in an elongated position. 